Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're doing a review and a little flight test on what we have here is the SEMA little S107 helicopter. And what these are are infrared. So they are not a 2.4, they are infrared like a remote control that operates your television so they don't fly well outside because of the sunlight um, the light different higher lights or fluorescent lighting will interfere with the signal so these are kind of like just mainly an indoor play helicopter so here we go this is what they look like really nice aluminum framing and body on here uh, on the tail we have a nice aluminum um, hollow tubular tail section on it and then everything is pretty much plastic from here on out that's very flexible and durable and other than that uh, they're pretty neat pretty neat little helicopters are about $20 you can get them for like 15 and uh, comes with a little charger that uh, USB charger that you just plug into your computer or any type of USB uh, wall socket like phone charger um, and then a little little plug here as you can see you plug it into this little square port right there to charge it so um, other than that let's get started let's go uh, let's go fly this thing I'm gonna get our professional drivers today to uh, take it for a test flight and today our professional driver is Kendall. I'll be flying the plane. Flight. And she'll be taking flight, the first flight of the helicopter. So let's turn this on. And we'll get this synced up. And right now we have the on and off switch right here. Let's turn this on. It'll blink. And let's get this synced up. It'll stop blinking once it's synced. Okay, there we go. The red light inside it, as you can see. All right. Okay, ready? Let's go take our first test flight. And our other helper here, Kylie, our other professional driver. Happy Easter for 2018. <laughs> I don't know. 2018, you're right. Yeah. Okay, ready? I think the age regulations on these are like 10 or 12 and old, older, I think, but here we go. Kendall is six, and she will be flying the plane. And that's what it does. And she is six years old, flying it. Hi. Try to keep it steady. Now go a little bit forward. There you go. Good. Turn towards you a little bit. Okay, you're going in circles. Okay, now go towards you a little bit. Okay, there you go. Perfect. And look how easy that looks. It flies very straight. How it's so easy. It's very easy, huh? It is. And it and it hovers very well. Because it's really easy. Uh, and bounce it off the ground a few times. There you go. Okay, keep it at one height. There you go. And you go forward a little bit or backwards. It goes forward, backwards. Yeah, that's you could adjust that with a little bit of the trim controls, but uh, other than that, uh, yep, she chases a sister and the dog. But anyways, that's about it, guys. So this is it. It's very easy to fly. Um, she has flown this a few times, so she. Uh, 
has had a little bit of practice, but it really doesn't take that much. You can actually pull these out of the box, and probably after about uh, three tries or so, you can fly it just as good as she is. And uh, it will last, the battery will last maybe about 10 times or so. About, I'm sorry, 10 minutes or so. So, um, yeah, so it lasts about 10 minutes. And uh, it takes probably about 15, 20 minutes to charge. That's about it. So it's actually, uh, they're pretty fun. Uh, Kylie, do you want to grab it and try running it real quick? No. No? No, Kylie doesn't want to try today, so, but she flies it just as good. Yeah, it's just a little scared because... But, Kendall... It's just a little scared because... Nico! Oh, Nico. Here's the dog. I don't chase you. And there's the other dog. I see. She likes chasing the dogs, too, but... Why don't you keep it at one height so I don't bob up and down here? There you go. There you go. Alrighty. So there it is, guys. Look at that. Look how cool that looks, eh? Alright. See how good that flies? She hasn't even crashed into the walls or nothing once. Yep, it moves real slow. It doesn't have a lot of forward or reverse speed to it, so. It goes down and up. Yeah. I'll tell you that. Uh huh. The force of gravity. That's called gravity. So, anyways, <laughs> the uh, the little tail, as you can see, the little tail uh, rotor on there. If I move, the tail. Yep. If you move it, the tail it rotor will spin. Will and it'll make it go forward or reverse. Yep, just like that. So, and there it is guys, the S107 by SEMA, or there's a lot of other knockoffs on the market that uh, are just as good. They look just like that and are easy to fly, so. But. You can like get 10 of these. Yeah, they're very, they're very cheap. They are pretty cheap. They're, uh, they're a good deal. I, like I said, you can get one for about 15, 20 bucks. So, um, and they're a lot of fun. You know, they're really easy for any of the kids to fly. So. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, there you go, guys. There it is. Thanks for watching, as always. And don't forget, have some fun. Get out there and RC more. Thanks a lot, guys. Say bye. bye.